Hey guys, Lucky HD here, and welcome back to another video. As you can see in this video, we got the face cam on, and we're gonna be doing a Nuzlocke today. So, before all of this starts, let me just mute this real quick. You all already know what happens at the start of Lumion Legacy. Uh, we're gonna be doing a Nuzlocke, and if we bring up the official Nuzlocke rules right here, it says that the Nuzlocke challenge is a set of rules intended to create a higher level difficulty while playing the Lumion Legacy games. Uh, many challengers feel that the rules serve a purpose, blah, 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 blah. Now, let's get on to the rules, okay? So, the rules are any Pokemon or Lumion that faints is considered dead and must be released or put into the Pokemon storage system permanently. In this case, all of this is just going to be Lumion related, I guess. Uh, the player must only catch the first Pokemon encountered in each area and none else. If the first Pokemon encountered faints or flees, there are no second chances. If the first encounter is the area in the area is a double battle in dark grass, the player must choose blah blah blah. Um, the general consensus is that a player must also nickname all of their Pokemon or Lumians for the sake of forming a stronger emotional bond. Uh, a black slash whiteout is considered a game over, even if there are Pokemon left in the PC. Um, Strongly applied, though not mentioned in the comics stipulation, is that player can only use blah blah blah, and we don't need we don't need to worry about people trading it uh, trading us because we have to get past the first gym, and I guarantee we probably won't get to that in one episode. So yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into this. And as you are already all already know, we already know what happens in the Start of Lumen Legacy. So I'm gonna get straight to the point where. I get to my starter and we'll go from there. So guys, we are at the starter screen and I know there is there is one rule that says you have to pick it based on the ID that you have in your uh, little like trainer card, but unfortunately, I'm stupid and I don't remember that. So, I guess we're just going to be going with my favorite and hopefully your guys' favorite Weevil. Let's pick him, or her, um, oh, I didn't give it a name, uh, oops, I'll go do that after this, uh, but now we have our Weevil, and we have to go beat our mom to death, so let's do that, um, she's gonna send out a Kabunga, hopefully Weevil will get the job done, I already know how to battle mom, now, See, okay, Static Shock, ooh, Static Shock is not very effective against the Kabunga, so there is a chance we could die here, but I don't think that's real, I don't think that's very likely at all. So it's gonna go for Pounce, and we're gonna go for Static Shock, not doing that much damage. Let's try Pounce, Let's see how much damage that does. Okay, it's just gonna raise its stats, I think. Oh yeah, it's, I think it's just gonna keep spamming brace. Let's be honest. Come on, die, Kabunga. Also, if you if you do see me in a game, uh, my username is the very inconspicuous, uh, not lucky HD, as you can tell. It's clearly not me. Why is Kabunga stronger than I remember? I feel like they buffed them. Or her. They technically. Is it her? Uh, oh, we're gonna have to wait out this turn. We're at 11 HP right now. That's not looking too good. I think, yeah, Kabung is lower than us, so. Good. Let's go for Pounce again. Ah, we gotta wait again. gonna keep spamming stat ups. Right, it's gonna wait out this turn. That should give us a chance to use Pounce and hopefully kill it. No, we are barely even scratching this Kabunga. It's just gonna keep spamming Brace. Oh, there we go. Critical hit. Nice. Alright, so we beat our mom to death. Um, that's pretty epic if I do say so myself. And are we leveled up to level 6? 
We got 240 Lumi dollars. I, I never, I never know. What, what were they called? Lumi dollars? Lumi bucks? Lumi coin? No. I don't know. Chesma Town. Ugh, all of this text. I gotta like spam click it. Alright, let's actually go name our Weevil. Uh, I guess, what should we name it? Um, I think a good name. Zap. No, let's, let's name it. I want to name it Noodle. Yes. Let's check the stats on it. Dull Clever. Clever's a pretty good nature for it. Um, what about training? Hmm. It's got pretty good stats. Nice. Okay. So now we're off to head to Route 1. And whatever the first Lumion we find in there is the first Lumion we get. And we can't catch any others except the first one. And if it dies or flees, then we miss that chance to get one. Uh, oh, I also need to go grab the potions. So let me go do that real quick. Here we are. Let's kick open these. And we have some small meds. And Lumi Discs. Nice. Is our Weevil already healed up? Yeah. Noodle is already healed up. I'm hoping to catch a Twilight. Um, or not a Twilight. A Twiddle. I want to catch a Twiddle. I think Aver Avertross is, should be really good for this playthrough. And Twilight, on the other hand... I mean, it's okay. I just don't like Twilight in general, but that's just me. Mother, I don't care. Stop calling me. You're just a hologram. Imagine if we had this technology in real life. Oh. Noodle doesn't know what to think of you. I don't know what to think of you either. Alright. First battle. Let's go. It's a Twiddle. Nice. Okay. Exactly what I wanted. And I don't want to use Static Shot because I don't want to kill it. Let's use Pounce. I think Pounce should lower it enough. Okay, I think we could go for like two more of those and we'll be fine. As long as we don't crit though. As long as we don't crit. <gasps> okay, we just, <laughs> we just hit a critical hit. That's not good. Um, Now's our perfect opportunity to catch this Twiddle. One, two, three. Nice, we got it on our first try. That means we still have four discs left over for more routes. So, what should we name this? Um, I guess Fly. There, perfect. Now we have Noodle and Fly, the dream team right here. And usually I would skip around these, but... I'm thinking we just battle all of them, honestly. Jeremy. Jeremy sent on a Twilight. The most ugliest Lumion in this game. Alright, let's beat it to death. We're gonna static shock it. That did a pretty good amount of damage. Let me move the mic out of the way real quick. There we go. And we're gonna go for another static shock. Perfect. I don't think he has any more Lumions. Hopefully not. Cathorn, okay. That shouldn't be too much of a problem, though. And I think XP share is already on, so Twiddle is going to get XP as well. Ooh, nice. That's not nice. Oh, wait, regain. Ooh. Hmm. We have enough to do one more static shock. Nice. Alright, Cathorn is down. Needle grew to level 7, nice. Um, I think... I think it'll evolve at 18, so that'll be pretty good. Let's go battle this boy right here. Uh-oh. Unfortunately, we can't catch this Twiddle, so we're gonna have to run from it. There we go. Daniel would like to battle. Well, Daniel. Oh, he sends out another Twilight. Oh boy. Let's kill it. Static shock. Get out of here. 
Oh, critical hit. Nice. And it's paralyzed. So I can't... Probably won't do any damage to us. That's gonna use Dottle. Dottle shouldn't matter that much. See, I keep I keep seeing these gifts right here. Um, a oh, gift is a beard somewhere in Boria. I don't think I don't think we'd be able enough to fight an icy ghoul. But hey. Okay. So we also on our journey we do not want to die. If we die, the entire run is over. So okay, it's gonna send a twiddle. Static Shuck should one-shot it because Electric is super effective to fly. There we go. Now, I will be skipping some of, like, the long dialogue that I... I don't want to, like, extend the video out for you guys. Uh, I know a lot of YouTubers like to do that. I'm not going to say I don't do that with some of my other videos, but I don't want to bore you guys, honestly. I, I want this to be a fun series. And let me know down in the comments below, um, do you guys want me to continue this? I mean, if you guys want me to, let me know down in the comments. And if it does well, then I will. So we got Cathorn down, and I think she has one more Lumion on her. Who to learn the move Stretch. Nice. 128. Oh, we almost forgot this part over here. And I did read this thing that... Gleamings are allowed, I'm pretty sure. If you, or if you find like a shiny or a gleaming out in the wild, you can catch it no matter if you caught a Lumion on that route before, so. Kick. Two capture discs. Nice. Go away from this Cathorn. Now we're on the Chesma Town, and Chesma Town, I'm pretty sure, it also has Gale Forest. And I think Dusk gets in Gale Forest. Um, we should be able to level up a little bit. And I hear a little Christmas jingle, so. Hmm. I think, yeah, gifts should be allowed. Let's actually buy some more discs real quick. And also, uh, small meds. Buy. And we'll get some capture discs. Ooh. Forgot, it's not like on my other account where I have like... 500k. Gotta spend my money wisely. Let's heal up our Lumions. Our two Lumions. Noodle and Fly. Heard it. There's another gift in here. Hmm. We'll have to come back for that later. Cause I oh, it's right there actually. Oh, we got this cutscene. I'll skip it for you guys. Don't worry, I won't bore you. Okay, now that we've got has that little bit of dialogue. Um. Oh. Uh, what? Uh, <laughs> Just widow Well, I guess we're not opening that gift. Um it just despawned right in front of our face. And on this route we have another twiddle. So welcome to the team, second twiddle. <sighs> that made that makes me like genuinely mad. We could have got something actually good from it, you know? We could have got like 5,000 Lumi dollars or whatever they're called. What do you guys think? Do you guys think we could do another pounce? Let's play it on the safe side. I'll throw one capture disc. If we don't get it in that, then I'll definitely do another pounce. I want to catch... As much as I don't want the Twiddle, I need it at the same time. If we want to go fight this Duskit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Oh, nice. Okay. It's just in the red, and that means... Zoom. One. Two. Three. Nice. Alright, so... 
what do we want to name this? We'll name this Fly V2. I think that's a pretty good name for it. Alright, let's skip all this other grass. I know that there's a trainer down here. Let's battle him. Looks like looks like ninja. Guys, is this ninja? Yes. Cade. His name's Cade. Alright, they're gonna send out a grubby. And we're gonna send out our Weevolt. Premonition. We're just gonna static shock it. Oh, I just realized. Uh, we didn't heal up our Weevolt. That's not good. Hmm. I think we should probably do that right now. It's gonna heal 20 HP for us. And we also gotta heal up our uh, Fly V2. gonna go for gnaw and we're gonna go for pounce. Nice. Alright. 30 experience from that. We're leveling up pretty quick. Uh, they're gonna send out another Cathorn. Hmm. I think Cathorn, like, I think bug types in general, they should all be weak to electric because, like, if you. If, like, you know how, like, there's bug zappers, you know, and, like, common sense tells you that if a bug runs into, like, an electrical current, I think it's gonna fry, right? Alright, Noodle grew to level 9. Uh, it's gonna send out another grubby. Premonition, premonition, whatever you wanna call it. Static shock? Oh, we don't have enough energy. Um, would Pounce be able to do the trick? Let's find out. No. Hmm. I guess we're just gonna have to. We're gonna have to wait. We're gonna get 32 energy from that. It's pretty good. It's gonna stare at me with its little yellow beady eyes. Grr. Now we're just gonna. No. Bug bite. You know, Yancy, I'd appreciate it if you take your little hello face out of here and just die. Oh, mystery toxins. Mystery toxins? You gotta be kidding me. Mystery, to mystery toxins? And I get sleep. That's, that's, that's funny. That's, ha ha. Good, good, funny, funny joke. Haha. <laughs> Die. Oh no. Oh no. Fly V2 is poisoned. Alright, Fly V2. I'm gonna have gonna have to ask you to suck it up until hmm. It's gonna send in another antsy. Oh god. Antsy is the most dangerous thing we have right now, us. Does poison wear away? I don't think poison wears away. Oh, oh god. Fly V2. What was that? I was trying to put my... Hmm. Thinking. Hmm. Fly V2 grew to level 7. That's great. But we can't even unlock poison heals yet because we don't have a... We don't have a Cinemoth, so that means we can't get poison heals. Or antidotes, or whatever they're called. I'm trying to think. Um. Yeah, that's grubby. That's great and all, but get out of here. Unless, actually, sleep wears away after a certain amount of turns, right? So. And there's no rule saying that we can't kill stuff in the wild. So, I mean. Why don't we just do that? And we hope that Noodle will wake up. Wake up, Noodle. I would like you to not be asleep. Oh, yes! Perfect. Alright. Zap that bird. Meow. 
now we gotta heal you up because I think up here is a trainer and then after that we gotta dusk it to fight oh boy that's gonna be great um let's heal up fly v2 in case we need him hmm. things are very tense right now because I don't want I don't want any of them to die so I want to save as many potions as possible for the Duskit fight. Tyler would like to battle. Well, Tyler, what is up with your hair? Some, like, anime hair or whatever. It's got, like, purple spikes. Not judging, but okay. Oh, God. I think Propay is just going to, like, brace spam and just infinitely heal or raise up its defense. No. Ooh, we got it paralyzed. Unable to move. Hmm. Let's go for another static shot. Because I think I think this dude only has two lumens, if I remember. I think he only has two lumens. 110 experience. That's pretty good. We're already at level 10. I think my next episode will probably be able to evolve into Stozap. That'll be pretty cool. Wait, was that only one? Did you know that? Did he only have one? Get out of here, Grubby. Hmm. Now oh, it's the big fight. I think before we do that, I th we should probably battle her. Alice would like to battle. Twiddle. Twiddle shouldn't be too high level. Level 7. I think we can manage that. We're level 10. I know you're supposed to battle her after the Duskit fight, but we kind of need these levels. I just want to be extra certain that we won't die. Because dying right now? Hmm. Mm mm. No, no, no. Oh, it's paralyzed too. Okay. Another Christmas gift. Hmm. Hmm. Fifty-six experience, and that puts us at level eleven. The last time I remember, Duskit, I think was level five. That he was at base level five. Comment down below what level you guys were when you battled this Duskit, because I'm I'm level eleven, and I think. Level 5 should be decent enough. I, I will never understand how you can transport a rock with a watch. When are we going to get that technical technologically advanced to where we can just call up our dad on a hologram and be like, no, 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 no. And then the rock just disappears. Like, what? There he is. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Corrupt dusk, it appears. Oh, it's level 8. That's uh, actually a high level. I think it, I think it, it's level goes, it's random. How much will our static shock do? Let's hope we can put it into paralysis. Brainwash. Uh-oh. Noodle became dazed. Oh no! Noodle, no! Can we get him one more static shock and hope we that he doesn't kill us? <gasps> A critical hit! And he flinched? Oh no, 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 no. We gotta use some of our meds. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Small med. Okay, okay. We're chilling. Startle. No. Let's use static shock. Stupefy. Noodle snapped out of it. Good. Zap that Duskit. Alright, Duskit needs time to recover, so it can't attack. Because it's a little energy thing. It's gonna heal up some of its stuff. And we're gonna hit it with another static shock. Nice. Okay. Just to be safe. Oh boy. Um. 
Let's use another small med. I don't want to die right here. That'd be really embarrassing. Stupefy. And one more. Final roost. Uh oh. Static shock. Okay. Dust gets gonna die, but Noodle's also gonna die. So. Dust can, can uh, yeah, now be found roaming in the wild. So that means, oh, we can't use, we can't use Weevil no more. That's a shame. Uh, I, did, I just I just now realized that. Blah 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 blah. Tiny old Monopoly man, get out of my face! I would not like to speak with you. All right. I'll meet you guys back at the Lumi Care Center where we are going to lay poor Noodle to rest in the PC box. <sighs> oh no. Well, we are gathered here today to me and this dude and anybody else? No, no, just me and him. We're gathered here today to commemorate the life of poor, poor, sad Noodle and struck fatally by a final roost by a dusket. May his soul lay to rest. We'll just name this box R.I.P. Rest in peace, Noodle. You were good for like the 30 minutes I've used you so far. You will always be remembered. And with that concludes our first episode of our Nuzlocke. If you guys did enjoy this series and you want me to play more of it, go down there in the comment section below and let me know how you guys thought about this series so far. Um, if it does good, I will do more and if you guys don't want me to do it, I won't do it. So make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.